Okay, guys, for today's video, we have a Z matchup. It's a pretty uncommon matchup that you probably face more in mid lane and in top lane. Uh, but still, I want to have at least once every matchup on my channel, and I don't think I have that one. So you're going to see what tricks I use to beat him early on, because later on, the Z is a really good champion into you, can kite you, make you use ult pretty easily, and then kite you, and then finish you off later, just like a Kali, just like a many champs like this, Kane, etc. So I'm going to show you how you can beat the guy, abuse the guy early on, and of course, bring that lead to victory. That's always the objective i hope you enjoyed the video if you do feel free to drop a like a comment or subscribe if you haven't already thank you for being here much love okay let's see z caitlin kazix well for now it's full ad into graves which is good for us because he has some natural armor. Okay, <laughs> it's not full AD anymore. Never mind. Um, who's top lane? Most likely Rumble, Zed mid, Brand support, and Caitlyn bot. It could be Rumble support. Now that Carrier played it, you can have plenty of fun, boys. Uh, let's see who did. Uh... I mean, if it's if it's rumble support, it will mean brand mid and Z top. It doesn't really make sense though. Yeah, it's most, it's most likely rumble top. We have Aphidio Seraphin bot lane. Well, we're not gonna have prior bot. That's for sure. Into brand gate lane. I mean, lane, wait, what runes do I have? Um, I'll actually probably keep that into Rumble and not go demolish. It's actually Z, Z top, but Rumble mid. Okay, I didn't think about that. It's fine though. I mean, Z is an easier matchup than Rumble early on, on the very first like, few levels. But then he scales pretty hard on Trint. The thing is, like, Z mid is way tougher to face than Z top. Because the lane in top lane is pretty long, you can still like run him down even if he has W to get you. Mm. So we need to try to abuse early on and make sure that we have Strike Breaker before he has any item. And keep snowballing from that. Also, like he has Splash TP, he doesn't have Exhaust, he doesn't have Ignite, which is gonna make it easier for us. Uh, Rumble is playing with Exhaust Ignite. Which is pretty cheesy. It's gonna make him really strong into Silas, like really, really strong. But later on, like let's say he didn't manage to get a lead, like yeah, if he's not fed or anything, he's gonna be pretty easy to catch for us. He doesn't have phase rush, he doesn't have a flash. It's gonna be pretty easy to kill him. If he doesn't get a lead. And then bot lane, even if they don't have Prayo, they have a really decent scaling. Okay, we saw someone. For Kha'Zix. Wait. Got creep blocked by my whole team. Body blocked it then. Um, there is a chance that Rumble used that time to put some vision top. Let me try to do this and this. Does it improve the quality? Can late invade? Can we? Okay. Oh, he's considering invading top. Well, that's a pretty good trade. I am a jungler stop. Did he base? Oh. Can deny the CS of XP. Ah, my E didn't hit. Bro, they're not dying. Ah, oh, that was so unlucky, though. 
when minions didn't die here. Okay. I missed one at least. Another one here. He's in a really rough spot. I think I think he should have TP'd actually. Maybe. Can I cheat consider diving? The only issue is that well because he has TP. Oopsie, I miss cannon, my ice warren minimap. Oh, they have vision here. Okay, well that's the first blood. I think I'm going double longsword. Because I'm actually taking like short trades into this Z. They're gonna be stronger. Um... Well, so far so good, plus we got a kill on bot lane. Silas is actually winning somehow. I should have stopped the trade earlier, no it's fine. As long as I can hold that freeze. Then it's a good it's a good ghost, I think. I'm gonna E, but I'm not gonna auto. This way I don't get hit by his whole minion minion wave. Well, he is doomed. Okay, Kha'Zix is helping. Well, that's the right play. Yeah, but <laughs> I was not isolated. Why the fuck do you flash here? Oh shit. Grace got invaded by Rumble and it worked. Let's go. I don't have demolish, so I'm not gonna greet for a plating. It's gonna take too long. Uh, let's go for tier one, tier one boots now. And Tiamat, why not? Even if freezing could be a play, actually. Mm -mm. Okay, so grubs are on the table. Oh. He's getting some first rate gold. An enemy has been slain. Still doesn't have W. Okay, does now. Oh, he's missing a ton of XP. Because I have Tiamat, it's gonna end up pushing to him. 
What is he doing? Uh, do I want to go and chase him? I mean, I could probably kill him if I do that. He still doesn't have TP. And he's not worth that much gold. And he's out anyway. So I think I'd rather just push mid here. Uh, push top. I mean... <laughs> and I don't have to ult. I'm so stupid. I really didn't consider that. And then I, I, I just like forgot that they still have my ult, I guess. Or just didn't like react in time. I was completely caught off guard. My bad, big time. I give a big shutdown to, to Rumble. Uh, they have a 2... Yeah, that's, that's a 2v3 here. They went a bit too deep. Okay, almost messed that up. Uh, but if it stays mid, I can push top. If you go stop, well, that would be the right play because mid is in a bad spot for us. Is he ult? He ulted. <laughs> he sub dropped the whole minion wave. For that. Okay, well we have six scraps, I have straight. This is looking really good, it's gonna be really easy now on my next goals to actually kill the Z. And if I do kill the Z, I get T1. Bro, he has, like, how much gold did he get from first strike? 260. And then he had three boots, so he has a whole eclipse. Damn. I 
if I take trades like this, at some point, it's just gonna be out. And he flashed. Uh, okay. No, his bot. I'll just take my base. Uh, let's see. So here, for example, some people ask me here, don't put a point in, in alt because I think that I will get my next level before I will actually use alt. So that's why I don't do it here. I can have different different reasons to not put points in alt, but here that's the reason. And I feel like that's something that people should do on every single champion. Like you're playing Karthus, for example. Well, if you're not gonna use your old before, uh, you can just use old and then you get you get a point to put. But don't put it in old, you know. If you're gonna get level twelve before outing again, I should probably go. But all right, they should go mid. Who's mid? Why does he want top and not mid? Okay. Let's not go too crazy until I have ult. An enemy has been slain. Rumble is looking. He's there now. I just take the turret. I guess it was a mistake though, because I was at the at the like early level eleven, not actually close to level twelve. But still, it works. Not looking. <laughs> Your team has destroyed a turret. Okay, let's see. Rumble is either pushing or hovering mid or basing. Ah! Nice. Okay, get Harold. We're getting everything. I have gold for Navori now. I got Navori, Red Trinket, Pink, and Longsword. I should probably be top now. Carafilios. No! 
man, I'm so stupid. I don't like I, at first I could have committed on just killing Zed, like he was so dead, but then I was like, this guy is like, like he's worth zero gold, and I don't want to uh, like spend my ult for that. And then Kazix was here, and then I was like, okay, the E Flash is gonna kill him, but the E Flash didn't kill him. And then I was like, at the very end, well, if I ghost, maybe I can get that last auto. And then it just, I just messed up. Uh, the good thing, though, is that now we have a gold reset on Zed. And Kazix used his ult as well. Nah, that whole thing is my bed. Oh, I thought more was coming. It's okay though. My idea was to get the jungler out because we're playing Drake. And the jungler is out, and we get Drake, so all good. All good. What could I need to sign in versus uh, Zed? Maybe Storm Razor is actually a good fit here. I want to be able to stick on him somehow. I didn't have ult. I didn't even know that they didn't have ult. That was so flippy by me. Okay, we should get Nash. Uh, I need a bit more gold for Storm though. I don't want to die for that. Ah, uh, this again, man. There's still work going upstairs and I don't know, like they seem to keep doing that whenever I stream, even if I stream at different times. Like if I'm if I'm gonna stream in the morning, they're gonna work in the morning. I guess so. It's okay, I'll try to mute my mic if I'm not talking too much. Okay, team on that. I'm just gonna push top. We have TP on Salas as well. The best play in those cases is actually to send the team on the side lane and the side lane are mid. But it's pretty hard to coordinate in solo queue.
When I flashed, I thought that they had trades of cooldown. Oopsie doopsie. If I can get that though. It's gonna be pretty good. Okay. Celeste fighting. 1v3. Good job. He can take game snow. There's enough damage. Oh, he's not going for it. I do it then. Why do I have a red trinket here? I know that they have no vision. Okay, well, let's just get Drake into triple inhib and look to end. And if we can't end, we just do Nash and, and then. Okay, they should be able to get the inhib 4v4 or so ahead. Well, I think it's Jover. We don't have anything crazy to do. Yeah, we just hold the pressure. It is. Well, I don't think I have any Z uh, matchup on my channel, so I might post it to YouTube. Might post it for educational purposes in that matchup. Um. Well, if I did, thank you for watching it, guys. Next video is going to be two more, same time, same place. And I'll see you next time. Peace, bye-bye, much love.